morning students i hope you are well in your home today we start next chapter 4.2 types of simple machine so here i draw a chalk machine Basically, machine is divided into two kinds: first lever and second incline plane. Again, further, lever is classified two type, uh, two kinds. That means pulley and wheel and axle. Here, incline plane is further classified screw and wedge. So, first we start lever. lever is a simple kind of machine we use them in our daily life so we can say that lever is a rigid bar which rotate about a fixed point or fixed line called axis of rotation this point or axis of rotation is called fulcrum the distance of fulcrum from the point which effort is applied is called effort arm the distance of fulcrum from point which load x is called load arm there are three type of lever first order of lever in first order of lever fulcrum is situated between load and effort like this here fulcrum here load here effort second order of lever in second order second order of lever load is situated between fulcrum and effort like this here load here fulcrum here effort third order of lever effort is situated in between fulcrum and load like this principle of lever it is stated that the product of effort with effort arm is equal to product of load with load arm 
तो हियर आई राइट प्रोडक्ट ऑफ लोड इनटू लोड आर्म इक्वल टू प्रोडक्ट ऑफ एफर्ट इनटू एफर्ट आर्म तो वी कैन राइट लोड अपॉन एफर्ट इक्वल टू एफर्ट आर्म अपॉन लोड आर्म तो अगेन वी कैन से दैट लोड डिवाइडेड बाय एफर्ट इक्वल टू एफर्ट आर्म डिवाइडेड बाय लोड आर्म इट इज कॉल्ड प्रिंसिपल ऑफ लीवर सो वी कैन से दैट प्रिंसिपल ऑफ लीवर स्टेट दैट द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ एफर्ट एफर्ट विथ एफर्ट आर्म इज इक्वल टू प्रोडक्ट ऑफ लोड विथ लोड आर्म फर्स्ट ऑर्डर ऑफ लीवर That means first type of liver. In this liver, fulcrum is situated between load and effort. Fulcrum, load, and effort. Okay. In this liver, the effort arm may be equal. or less than or more than the load arm in case if the effort arm is more than load arm less effort required to move the load in case if the effort arm less than the load arm more effort required to move the load thus its mechanical advantages are one more than one or less than one the example of first type of lever sisa head pump scissor and so second order of lever in this type of lever load is situated between fulcrum and effort in this type of lever load arm always smaller than effort arm thus we have less effort to required a more heavy load nut cracker is the example of second order of lever this lever is also called effort multiplier lever or force multiplier lever third order of lever in this lever effort is situated between load and fulcrum in this lever effort arm is always smaller than load arm thus more effort required to lift a lighter loads this type of lever 
is also called split multiplier lever example fire tongs bread knife my next topic is pulley first we define pulley pulley is a flat circular disc having grooves its edges and capable of rotating around fixed point passing through its central axis commonly called axle in a way axle is a fulcrum which pulley rotates around pulley is a made up of metal even wooden pulley is used in villages there are two type of pulley system first single fixed pulley system second single movable pulley system first we start single fixed pulley system it consists of single pulley it is attached it is attached to higher platform and around its groove passes a rope one end of the rope is attached to load effort is applied at the other end of rope this pulley are commonly used in drying water from village wells second single movable pulley system a combination of two pulley is called single movable pulley system in this kind of pulley system the load of say 100 kg f can be raised by effort of 50 kg f in this is the practical example of in this system crane crane lifting heavy loads you must have seen crane lifting heavy loads crane is a practical example of lever and pulley working unison 